Hello beautiful souls, it's Karen at Soul Magic 99 and I'm here with your love scopes for July and we're doing future love, we're going to look at see what future love is coming in I just want to thank you all for watching, liking, sharing, subscribing don't pr forget to press the like button and don't forget to subscribe when I get to 2.5 thousand subscribers there is a giveaway to two people of a deck or reading as a big thank you and every time I reach a milestone I do do giveaways so don't forget to check out my card shops. A lot of the decks I'm using are my own design here. So today we're doing Future Love of Scorpio. So let's have a look and see what's coming in for Scorpio for July. So guides and angels, please advise Scorpio. Who is their future love coming in for Scorpio? Guides and angels, who is the future love coming in for Scorpio? It's the future love coming in for Scorpio, please. We've got the strength card, so it could be Leo, it could be a Leo fire sign here. But it could be somebody that's very strong, very emotionally strong. They could be very physically strong. So, um, guides and angels, please advise Scorpio, who is this person coming in, this future love? And remember, energy is fluid. It doesn't necessarily mean it's going to come in in July. We've got judgment energy here. So something that you've been working towards... The judgment's going to be in your favour. Maybe this is something you've been wishing and hoping for to meet the right person here. So can you tell us about this person for Scorpio, guys and angels? We've got Knight of Wands energy. So fire sign energy here again. So Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Sometimes the Knight of Wands energy is seen as that player energy. But I'm not picking that up. I'm picking up that this could be somebody younger than you. And they're very passionate, okay? They're a passionate person in their life and, and in general. And I think they're going to be very passionate about you, Scorpio. So is the attraction instant here for Scorpio? I mean, fire and water opposites attract here. So is the attraction instant here for Scorpio? We've got Nine of Wands energy. So I feel that you are feeling like you want to stand your ground with this person. You do want to see what where things go like you want to give it a chance is what i'm thinking so what is the person like can you tell us any more about this person for scorpio guides and angels can you tell us any more about this person for scorpio please guides and angels can you tell us any more about this person for scorpio we've got six of coins energy so that's that balanced energy this is a person very balanced okay and they're good at the giving and taking in relationships. And they're in a balanced energy within themselves as well. So what challenges might there be in this connection, guides and angels? What challenges might there be in this connection? What challenges might there be in this connection? Page of Wands energy. So could be a bit immature energy with that page, but there is definitely a little passion. You know, it may start off maybe as a passionate connection. It may not start off as anything that you feel is going to go anywhere. Um, so it may start off as just like um, like a flirtation, um, a passionate energy here. So what might help this connection, guides and angels? What might help this connection for Scorpio? What might help this connection for Scorpio? We've got Ten of Coins energy. So... I feel you're wanting something solid, you're wanting that commitment, you're wanting a home and family. And I feel it's having that, being honest and open with what it is you truly want for yourself here, okay? So when or how might you meet? So you need to be open and honest with the person, what it is you truly want in this connection, because you seem to be on different pages here initially. So when or where might you meet this person? Guys and angels, can you please advise where... Or when Scorpio might meet this person. We've got eight coins. So it could be in the workplace. It could be while you're doing a creative project. Maybe you're going to join uh, a class or something. Um, this person is like carving, I think. So you could be doing something creative. And you could meet them on a creative project or something like that. So what's the overall outcome for this connection? We will go deeper with these energies anyway. What's the overall outcome for Scorpio in this connection, guides and angels? 
page of cups energy so yeah i mean it's the start of something i think the start of love you know the 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 budding you know the flourishing of something in the love department but it, it's not a full-fledged you know love at first sight energy i feel it's going to build if you allow it to so let's have a look can you tell us any more about this person so we have knight of wands energy guys and angels can you tell us any more about this future person for scorpio we've got nine of shillings energy so this is an independent person this is somebody financially stable as well they're used to being on their own they're not a needy person okay so they're in a good energy they they like being in their own energy they're they're independent so will the attraction be instant here Gods and angels, can you advise Scorpio? Will the attraction be instant? We've got nine of roses, so I definitely think so because this is like that wish fulfillment. This is somebody you've manifested. This is somebody that you really do find very attractive. You know, it ticks a lot of boxes for you. Okay. So, as I said, what challenges might there be in this connection? Gods and angels, what challenges might there be? In this connection got four of swords energy so that's that healing energy um, maybe they've come out of another connection and they're taking that time to heal they don't want to rush into something else straight away so what might help this connection guys and angels please advise Scorpio what might help this connection We've got justice here, so I feel it's just being fair to each other, just giving each other the space you might need, okay, and just be having those open, honest um, conversations. So can you tell us any more about where Scorpio might meet this person? Guides and angels, where might they meet this person? We've got seven rods energy. So again, you could be feeling defensive. You could both be feeling a bit defensive. When you do me, okay. What's the overall outcome here for Scorpio, guides and angels? And I think it's just giving each other that time and space to work through these energies because there is a lot of attraction here. So, what's the overall outcome for Scorpio, guides and angels? What's the overall outcome? We've got the Tower energy here, so it doesn't have to be a bad energy. Something could happen to shake things up here. But then we've got the temperance energy. You're coming into balance. And this could be your divine masculine. We've got the, oh my God, we've got the emperor and the empress. So it looks to me like you are divine counterparts here. Okay, you are destined to meet. This is a fated meeting, but you might need to give each other that time. Okay, to really get to know each other. So let's have a look at some more energies. So what is your person like? Guys and angels, please advise Scorpio. What is this person like? What is this person like for Scorpio, please? What is this person like? You love their sense of style. They have a, a unique just sense. You do feel love for this person. You do want to stay with this person. You see them as someone very intelligent. You like the way they look after themselves, they take care of their appearance and they have a twinkle in their eyes which you really find attractive. So overall very attractive person. So guides and angels, please advise Scorpio where, when or how might they meet this person? Where, well, or how might they meet this person? Guides and angels, where, when or how might they meet their person? Where, when or how might they meet? person we've got start a business so maybe this is somebody you're going to consult about starting a business somebody giving you advice it says in a few weeks say yes to new adventures so you could be meeting them very soon and we've got romantic movie at home so i feel that you you know, could hang out with this person at home. It's going to be romantic. OK, 
can you give us any dates of when they might meet this person? Any other information about when they might meet this person? We've got June, so we're still in June at the moment. We've got transport, so it could be while you're travelling around. You could meet them on public transport or in a taxi. We've got day out. Maybe you're going to meet them at a day out. And you could be going away together for a weekend here in the future. So let's have a look at what this connection is about. Guys and angels, can you please advise Scorpio any more about this connection? As I say, it does look like your divine counterparts here. This is your soulmate or twin flame. Who is this person? Who is this person? So we've got playful fun times. So I feel you're both, you know, we said that the night of one can be that, you know, that player energy. But I feel it's going to quickly turn into love, as I said. That you can have fun together. And it's all about having that love for yourself because you'll then be able to love each other. And you're going to spend time getting to know each other here. And you need to release control of, of this situation and just go with the flow. And we've got surprise proposal here coming out. So for some of you, it could lead to this commitment. So let's just look at some final outcomes. See what we get for Scorpio, Gods and Angels. Please advise Scorpio. What is the outcome of this connection? Yeah, you see your person as very sexy, sexy and single. You dream about them, daydream about them, what might be when this... Yeah, you manifested your ideal partner and you've been positive thinking, you've been manifesting this person, you've been manifesting each other, I feel. Anything else about the outcome here? We've got strong chemistry. So it's picking up on that between you. Very strong chemistry here. You, They see you as sexy. So you're both really sexually attracted to each other here. Any other outcome message? Yeah. It's going to lead to love here. It's going to lead to love. Loving commit a loving relationship here, so that's as far as I can go at the moment. So let's get your advice for July, Scorpio, guides and angels. Please advise Scorpio. What advice do you have for Scorpio, guides and angels for July? You've got spirit guide. I feel your spirit guides really bringing you together with this person we've got courage it's going to take courage we have you know we've got the line here with the line there so it could be a leo as i said but this relationship is going to bring you a lot of well-being and there may be travel involved you may go traveling together with this person so beautiful energies there scorpio so have a great month sending you lots of love and blessings bye for now